Official Kyiv. West wants to push Ukraine to reduce intensity of war. The statement of NATO representative Stian Jensen shows that the West wants to push Ukraine to reduce the intensity of war and turn the current situation into a long-term conflict, Mykhailo Podolyak, advisor to the head of the Office of the President of Ukraine, said. He said that Jensen's call to Ukraine to give up territory was not an accidental statement. He actually said that the war should end with our defeat. According to Podolyak, Jensen's apology is unimportant. The opinions he expressed could cause a serious disaster. Ukraine and Russia show no sign of wanting to negotiate an end to the 18-month-long war, with Kyiv focused on trying to expel the invaders from within its borders while Moscow aims to consolidate the territory roughly the size of Portugal it has seized since February 2022. Mykhailo Podolyak criticized the idea of handing over territory. Criminals must not be encouraged by the phrase land for peace, he said. The territories of Crimea and Donbass are the unconditional territories of Ukraine and therefore the only way to really stop the war is to return international law to these territories, he added. Podolyak, who had previously criticized Jensen's comments as ridiculous, was primarily taking aim at Nicolas Sarkozy, the former French president, who gave an interview to Le Figaro calling for diplomacy discussions and talks to end the war. Sarkozy said there was an ongoing risk of military escalation if the war continued. Without compromise, nothing will be possible and we run the risk that the situation will degenerate at any moment. This powder keg could have frightful consequences, he said. Podolyak called it unacceptable.